Hello, 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 and welcome back, everybody. Oh, my chair makes noises now. I'm sorry. I'll try to refrain from the thing. Uh, <laughs> welcome back to a little bit more Universio. Now, we've got some things to look at, because I did some stuff in between episodes, as I said I would, because I am good at my, my job being this. So, I think I finished the stairs. I then just... I ground, uh, ground, 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 grind, grinded, ground. I waited around for more cosmic dust to generate. So much so that I've got 2,000 here. I've also got 260 cosmic ingots just from cooking up some dust. And then I went as far as crushing a load of the cosmic dust until we have at least 100 of everything. So there's some that have plenty more. Wait a sec. Oh, it's hydrogen. Yeah, it's fine. Uh, some pl plenty more, but some are just about at a hundred. Like uh... argon took a while. Um, so we've got about hundred plus of every resource. Uh, I I did this. This is just a little setup just to have. Uh, you've got the hopper pots. Um, just bringing in some passive stuff, and I did it for wheat as well, just so we can passively generate wheat while we're sort of chilling here. But there's a to-do, so let's let's recap some of the things I learned. First off, iron buckets. So we can actually make iron buckets now, and that was our issue with the crucible. If we pick up the crucible, and then we pick up our buckets, and we go here for a second. Uh, well, this is probably not going to be the best place for it, because we don't have any water here. Um, but if we... Take some iron, Fe, and we do this, and we put a bucket in the middle, and we do this, we can get a normal bucket, which, if you remember, what we'll do is we'll, we'll try and be, I don't like placing stuff on the, the little planets, uh, we'll, be, we'll be smart and I'll demonstrate this. So, water bucket, wooden bucket. Uh, gravity. Uh, gravity. Sure. Um, if we remember, place this down. Cannot place water into the crucible. Water bucket, though, places. So, we now have the ability to actually use the crucible. That's step one of learning to be a person. Uh, so now we have the iron buckets done. Oh, we also... This was just the stuff I was bookmarking for hoppers. Um, so that's good. Let's get two buckets of water, because actually it would be nice to have um, some infinite water in our overworld of, uh, of stuff. Um, um, <laughs> let's put it over, over here, maybe. One, two... Oh, I can't see what I'm looking at. Three, four... That feels it feel Water can't live here. Okay. That's really annoying. Water can't live here, so we shouldn't be even here. Uh, let's just leave. Um, and we will place this back down where it was. Let's place it here and place some water in it. Right. So that is... Uh, don't look in that chest. You saw nothing. Close your eyes. Close them. That's on the list. So, iron bucket. Done. Next thing is loot purgatory houses. So, one thing I will explain to you guys is, you know, last time we were, we got stuck in purgatory, so we made a... Interesting, wait. Okay, we're going to leave that because that seems cursed um, and that's fine. Uh, we, we built the hearthstone to ex escape purgatory, but actually we were given an item at the start that we had no understanding of. I now understand it. So what you can do is with the, it's called a tempad, you right click it, you can do run program, so you can add locations in and then once you've got them in, you can literally click, you can click teleport, it opens this little door, you can walk through it and it's going to take us straight to purgatory which is crazy. 
So then what we can do in Purgatory, again, I did some learning, I did some research. We can come over here and we can go, oh my god, there's barrels. And these barrels have iron and all sorts of ingoty things in. And we can just take them. Like this. And now we've got nickel, we've got aluminum, we've got lead, we've got iron, and we've got copper. That's pretty cool, if you ask me. And we can take their saws, just to make them angry. Um, and yeah, there's plenty that we can loot in here. Um, I just didn't realise, because I think I was more confused and panicky. Like the, A blast furnace! We'll have that for sure. And then we can just be like, okay, we're bored here. And run program, and we can go back to uh, home nothing. Teleport. Another little cool door appears. Bang, we're gone. This angers me that we didn't use this earlier. Um, but that's fine. So now we know how to get those resources. Um, we can dig down. We're not going to do that right now. I think we're going to do this. Acid, sulfur, cauldron. So, I think from the research that I've done, and I tried to avoid, like, spoiler spoilers, but people are saying to use the periodic table. So something like sulfur will make sulfuric acid. So if we go to our thing over here, and we put sulfur in. Is it? Was it not sulfur? Was it phosphor, maybe? Wait, there was one. Basically, people said to look at the periodic table, and I considered a couple things. Phosphorus. Let's try phosphorus. Wait. Uh, okay, let's try phosphorus. Wait. One of these makes an acid. I'm sure of it. Aha. Uh, uh -huh. So if we just chuck all of this in. Look at it. It's getting real red. I think that's as red as it goes, but it's used almost a stack of phosphor, and now we can chuck our smooth stone in, and now we have a stack of compressed stone. See? So compressed stone is sulphur in the water. We're getting there now. Um, oh, we have a quest to finish here. Uh, okay, so industrial age though. So now we've made compressed stone, we can make, oh, can we make a furnace? Oh my god, this is, this is groundbreaking to not have to use fireplaces anymore. Oh, that is, that is a joy to behold right there. Um, let's have a look at the quest then. So that's the fireplace done. So now the, the compressed iron was Fe into acid. So again, if we come back here, because we've prepped all of this, we can literally just whiz out a stack of this. Where's that another stack of phosphor? Uh, then let's go. Come over to our cauldron. Because I think it loses its acidity as it goes. So we can chuck these in. Already back to red. Perfect. Didn't use that many. And then we can chuck a stack of you in. And now that's a stack of compressed iron as well. We're absolutely geniuses, based on the fact that I did lots of research. <laughs> We've learnt nothing. Uh, fortified rock. So, reinforced stone is just regular stone surrounded But Okay, well we can do that now because we can cook cobble. Because we can go here, and then... We don't have coal though, do we? How did we make coal again? Wait. Coal. Uh, oh yeah, we, we could probably do coal. Um, or we could do, because, um, again, tempad, run, lava pool, teleport. We've got a bucket on us. Perfect. Whiz in here. Bingo bongo. And then just tempad again, run program, home, teleport. Look at that. The tempad is actually the coolest thing cool and that will create us some stone so that will allow us to make fortified stone unsure what this is for that's fine we can now make pressure tubes we just need glass that's also okay uh, and then makeshift pump gas lift 
don't know what a gas lift is for. A uh, gas lift is a type of pump which uses pressure to pump up liquids. When placed down, it requires pressure and drill pipes to operate. The okay, okay. We can work with that. I don't fully know what that is. But I'm, I'm guessing it needs us to refine the oil that is under the ground. Um, because if I come to... I need to go into controls, uh, keybinds, because I think... Excav... <sighs> Shoot. I've forgotten what it's called now. It's the the fast mining. Because I don't want to mine myself. Damn it. Alter mine. Here we go. Set to grave. If we set it to button four. Right. So now we've got alter mine on. I can uh, hold shift. I see. And we can do uh, small tunnel, mining tunnel. We want, like, mining tunnel? Yes, that's what we want. We want mining tunnel. So if we go and we run program purgatory, teleport. Looks like we are doing this now. I said we weren't going to do it now. But apparently this is happening. Uh, so that's fine. Let's do it here next to this house. And we do that. Then we do that. Because it's just a lot of sand. Then we do that. Eventually, we're going to blitz through this. Uh, but it takes a while to, to get down there, I think. I hope at some point we hit a harder level of sand. But I don't know if we do. Let's see if maybe doing this works. Are we even, we're not even affecting things, I don't think, right now. So let's just mine quickly. Oh, as fast as we can. It's not, it's not quickly. The altar mine didn't seem to be working to dig. Oh, purge stone, okay. Why is it not, oh, there we go. That looked like it did a thing. I think. Unsure. Wait. We're getting there. We need to just understand what's happening first. I don't know why the altar mine's not working. I think it did work, right? Yes, it did work. Okay, that's fine. We just need to... There we go. Uh... I think we want to do one more. Yeah, that looks pretty good. Uh, and then we'll just quickly free ourselves from this hole. See, the progress is mad when I do a tiny bit of research. This was unfortunately the main spoiler that I probably received. Um, because while trying to find out how to do acid, I saw someone down here. And it was a bit like, ah, a bit annoying. But still kind of useful. Because this stuff takes ages to mine through. And would I have ever done this? Maybe not. Maybe not. But I'll tell you one thing for sure. We're going deep down. Cool. Uh, we can grab all this purged stone though. Is this useful for anything? Not really. Cool. Uh, but that's fine. We'll tempad it anyway, and you'll be able to see how I save a location on the tempad. Um, so basically, you want to come all the way down. We're probably never going to use these stairs again, to be fair. Um, yeah, fun fact. They are almost useless once we use the tempad to save the uh, stuff. Can I... There we go. And we'll pick it up anyway. I don't I don't fully know if we'll have a use for it in the future. But, I mean, it doesn't hurt to have it. Look how... Like, without Ultimine, this would have taken ages. And I completely forgot Ultimine was in the pack. Which is one of the reasons digging down took me so long to start with. And I've noticed everyone's still using the, the special pick they give you. Rather than making stone picks. So I thought to myself, why am I the only one... Probably still using a stone, like making stone picks. So we have stopped doing that. Uh, and now you'll see we're actually at a layer of crude oil. Um, what I'd like to do is jump into it and place and place. 
there we go and now if we go alt mine and we do shift and let's do a small square oh ooh. swimming through this oil is horrible three uh, then one two three one two three let's do then one two three and then one two three perfect get ourselves this area kind of settled a bit so we can place a uh, location for the tempad down here. It's very echoey. I didn't realize that. It's, it's like being in a very hollow cave. But let's cover up half of this and then let's show you how to add a tempad location. So stand where you want, you then go run program, add program, and then we'll do, we'll just call this crude oil. Oil. Add location. Now that's added, so let's have a look at this quickly. So you'll see, this is literally a whole layer of crude oil, and then there's some magma blocks down below. It's very hard to swim to through, so I probably won't be going for those magma blocks right now, because I think I drown. Um, but yeah, so this is another area, which I'm imagining all these quests are leading me to, is pumping crude oil out of the ground. So let's go back home, run program, home earth, teleport, there's our door, whiz on through, and I mean let's just chuck all of this in here for now, get rid of it at least, there we go, that's a lot of crude stone, perfect, there's our eight that we need, so now we can take this and we can make reinforced stone, which is a quest complete, oh, and it wants us then to make Reinforced bricks? Okay, so we can do that. That's fine. Reinforced bricks. Okay. Right. And then it wants us to make pressure chamber walls. Okay. Right. So we need... I was going to say, can we actually break that? We need tons of uh, reinforced uh, bricks, basically. Okay. That's fine. We can definitely do that very easy. The stone takes a long time to get. Um, let's make a second furnace. What we'll do is we'll also put this here. Then we'll grab another stack of stone and we'll use the feature of this mod that's very handy and we will speed up time so that those start to burn many more things for us. Because otherwise we're just going to waste our time waiting for furnaces to be able to build some pressure chambers. But basically we're making, doing pneumatocraft now, which is quite cool. Um, so this has done 20, and this has done 26. Perfect, that's put us almost at a stack. So we can do this, Ooh, then we can do this, then we can take all of these and do this, which will make us these. And then we do this, which will make us pressure chamber walls. And we can make a full stack of it. So why not? So it now wants us to make a pressure chamber valve, pressure chamber interface, and some pressure chamber glass. So this requires... Okay, so we can do this quite easily. Uh, we can do this quite easily. Yep, sure. Uh, and we can do that fairly easily. It's not too bad. Um, so let's craft up some stuff. So we need glass. That is something we need plenty of. Uh, so this was me running around in the underground uh, harvesting some stuff just to test and see that everything did work and it does. Um, so glass is what we're after. Do we have any sand at all? No, we, we, never, we never really got an easy sand method, did we? Um... Yeah, it's just world transformation for now, which is fair enough. We can do that. Uh, let's just go and pop our heads out here where we started doing this initially. And let's just quickly convert more, oh, more of this into sand, sure. Oh, oh, I didn't, I didn't really want to do that. I think what I want to do is shapeless. 
yeah, shapeless. And that at least speeds us up a little bit, and then we can... Uh, let's just do that. 24 will do for now. We're not after massive amounts of glass. Uh, we can then maybe whiz you out, whiz you in, put you in here instead, which will do nicely. So, we need glass for this, that's fine. We need a hopper, sure thing. Hopper, very doable now that we've got plenty of iron from... Oh, we could also make this into... Huh? This, oh, wait, what? Hmm? Uh... Oh, did that duplicate the wooden bucket for us? I think it did, because it had water in it when we did the uh, when we did the old crafting, and it made a phantom bucket, I guess, of some sort. Uh, we'll make two for now, just because we feel pretty rich, um, and that means we can make two of these, which means we'll make four of these. And I, I, I sure. Sure. Um, we can then come over to here. Let's wait for this one. Six. Perfect. We'll then do three of the uh, tubes. Three of the tubes. And then we'll do... Because we need to make two sets of you, because that's seemingly what we're doing for everything right now. Uh, and then we can make three sets of you with the rest of the glass. Perfect. Right. Copper dust comes from pressure chambering. I see, okay. So basically it wants us to make a pressure chamber now. Which is fine, but we don't have any way to use the pressure chamber? Um, that was a very high-pitched ollie right there. Gas air compressor. Okay, we can do that. We can do that. Uh, we need to make another furnace. And then... Sorry, what was it? Let's just bookmark it real quick. Oh, we've done that. Sorry. My bad. Uh, so, an air compressor. Which, again, another quest that we're just blitzing through. Advanced air compressor. <gasps> How do we do it? Oh, we're very far off that. That's fine. Okay, so my understanding is low of everything. I'm a, I'm a man that doesn't know much. But we have now done this, we've done this, we've done this, and we've done this. So, our board of to-do is actually a board of nothing, because we are good at what we do. Um, I don't know whether I want to be building in here or in the overworld. Um, this is where our stuff is. So it maybe makes sense to be here? Let's build here for now. Okay, so my understanding of pressure chambers is as follows. So let's try and build it kind of reasonably. I just, I can't see things, but it's very crowded there. Right, we're gonna give it a go. Uh, yes. So my understanding is we can make a very small one to start with. Um, we want this made an achievement, you vandal. Okay. Uh, so if we put this back here. Oh, wait, we want to spin this round. Wait. Uh, we want this back here. And then we want the pressure chamber valve here. Then we want interface here and I think we want to place this so that it's orange facing like that so it's blue then orange yeah I think this makes sense and then we can actually put a piece of glass here and then Uh, 
is that not big enough? Does it have to be a um, a three by three internal? Uh, not too sure, but let's try. Let's try grow it. I, I don't. I don't. I don't want to do too much research because I don't want to be just relying on the fact that I've looked it up and people are like, okay, well that's not bought. I, like I don't. I want people to watch my content because they're like, Ollie doesn't know what he's doing, and it's funny because of that. Not because they're like, ugh, we're just going to watch Ollie immediately blitz through all of this. Um, which will never be the case, don't you worry. Your little cotton socks. Uh, we actually don't have enough uh, pressure chamber bits, I don't think. Uh, we still need to break one of these to put a valve. Valve here. Um... And then we need to top it, so we need more, more pieces, uh, which I think we can make some more, because it's just this, right? Yeah, we can make more. I think that might be enough, actually. Uh, let's use our old disable gravity, re enable gravity. That's fine. Good way to scale buildings, just controlling gravity at will. Okay. Aha just needed to be bigger that's fine um, so then what we can do is we can come back here and we can place this and then we can pipe this bad boy up and then this requires something to cook now I'm wondering if we can uh, lava pool teleport I'm wondering if we can cook lava in it or whether it needs to be coal Tempad, run program, uh, home nothing, teleport. Where's my door? Is it in this wall? I don't think there's enough space here fully for uh, the tempad sometimes. I have had issues where it just, it makes the noise but nothing else. Let's go further back. Uh, home nothing, teleport. Yeah, there you go. I think it was in the wall somewhere. It's fine. Um... So let's see if we can chuck lava in this and it will generate pressure. No, so it will have to be coal, um, which is fine because we just need carbon. Uh, meant to hit one of the crafting tables. It's fine though, so we can come here, it's literally this in the corner and then everything else carbon. And that's fine. We can then run over here slap some carbon in here get that bad boy cooking so now my understanding is no problem okay so my understanding is now for example copper uh, see you we just take a load of this we ram it into here um. Uh, importing items. Maybe we need, uh, maybe we need a hopper. Maybe we can't do it manually. Let's have a look, ski. Uh, <laughs> what am I doing? Uh, hopper, yes just become an idiot. Okay. Something's happening. Something's happening. Right. Something's happening. Right. What is going on? Bloody show me. Apply more pressure. Oh, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, for this, it's saying it needs two bars of pressure. Got it. So maybe this needs more time or we need more compressors. 
So we can make another compressor, right? Uh, do we have the stuff on us? No. But it wasn't hard to make, I don't think. Ooh, this episode's running long. Uh, buh, 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 buh. Uh, buh, buh, buh. Uh, what did we need? Uh, we needed a furnace. And then we need, ah, we need more, more of you to make, uh, this, to make this, to then make this into bricks, to then make this. So we made another one. Now let's go over to the, the dark world. And this will then double our pressure production. Uh, we just need a pipe. And then we need to maybe like, take half of you, put you in here. And now these will produce faster bars. So we're at 0 0.27. Sorry, you're telling me we're at 0.27 and we need to get to 2? Well, I think that's telling me this is where the episode ends for now. Thank you very much for watching. I hope you've enjoyed seeing how we progressed and I will see you in the next one. Oh wow, you've actually made it this far. Okay, um, three things. Um, don't forget to maybe watch another video. I don't know which side I'm on. These ones, this or this, there's a box with a video. Um, consider subscribing and maybe like the video. Leave a comment, I'll, I'll say hello. Anything, go, go wild.